because we stopped just about at every port. You see, this boat was just had a few passengers, I think about 50 passengers, and the rest was cargo. Mm -hmm. So it would deliver cargo to different places. Mm -hmm. And wherever we went, we always stopped two or three days. Mm -hmm. And uh, that was, oh, that was a really good trip. And then we stopped in the Suez Canal. Mm -hmm. uh, and, well, we went, no, we went, yeah. I have to have a map to see how we went. But anyway, we went to Suez Canal, and I was standing at the railing, mm -hmm. waiting to go abo aboard with my my family. And it's hotter than Hades over there, let me tell you. So I'm standing there, and I look this way, and I look that way. I don't see anybody. There's nobody there but me. <laughs> and then. All of a sudden, out of nowhere, comes this black hand with a little chicken in it, and he keeps saying, Kila, Kila, Kila. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Let me tell you, I almost jumped overboard. It scared me so bad. Mm -hmm. And it frightened me too, so I looked at him and I thought, I don't know you, and I ran. I ran back to the cabin. Mm -hmm. As, but finally, we went aboard. And uh, I wish I could remember the town. What town is at the Suez Canal from? Cairo. Cairo. Mm -hmm. Well, I guess that, well, wherever we went. Um, it, was, uh, it was very nice, except the captain warned us, he told us. He said, you only go on the main streets. Mm -hmm. Main street. You cannot veer off of the side street because he says they'll kill you. Mm -hmm. So we stayed on the on the street, you know, on the street. And, and anyway, we weren't gone very, very long. We went to a restaurant and, and we looked at the shops, you know, and whatever they had. We couldn't go very far because it was too dangerous for foreigners. Mm -hmm. And mind you, that was back in 1933. Mm -hmm. uh, we weren't like very well. Mm -hmm. So then we get back on board, and then we go to India. Mm -hmm. I liked India. We went to Calcutta and to Bombay. Mm -hmm. Now at that time, I I didn't like Calcutta. Mm -hmm. uh, I had, uh, of course, you know, you always get all dressed up with your white shoes and your little white socks and all that. So we get off and there are these shoe shiners. They insisted on shining my shoes, you know, with black shoe polish. <laughs> and I said, <laughs> oh, they, oh, they're a pest. Mm -hmm. Oh, they are a pest. Talking about beggars. Mm -hmm. never saw so many beggars. So we went around there. I don't remember what we did in Calcutta. I'm sure we had a good time. Oh, yeah. Ten. And then we get back on board ship. Oh, yeah, and I must tell you, when we left Holland, we went through the Gulf of Biscay. Mm-hmm. And that gulf is never, never quiet. Mm hmm There is always a storm. Mm-hmm. So I'm on this ship. And they have very wide staircases. So I go up, you know, and I go to the dining room. There's nobody there, just John and me. And we kind of wonder what's going on. And of course, they had, I don't know how they did, but they had a ring around the table so our plates wouldn't fly off the table. <laughs> oh, no. Because the ship rolls, see, mm -hmm. like that. And so then the stewardess, who I absolutely adored. Mm -hmm. uh, she was, I think, five foot tall and five foot wide. Mm -hmm. She was, oh, she was a doll. As a matter of fact, she wanted to adopt me. Oh, really? Yes. 
And uh, so she told me, she said, well, the best thing for you to do is to have a good hearty breakfast. So John and I had a good hearty breakfast. Mm -hmm. It no sooner went down and I started to walk and you, you can't walk real good because the ship is rolling. And all of a sudden I realized, I said, oh my God, oh my God, I gotta run, I gotta run. So I ran to go back to the, to the well, actually go to the bathroom. I ran and then I don't know which way <laughs> the ship went, when it went. It must have gone down, you know, it goes into the water, mm -hmm. the front part because I got to the steps and it took me. Mm -hmm. I never touched one step going down <laughs> and there were a number of them and I landed smack mm -hmm. on the floor and mm -hmm. never touched the steps. The <laughs> ship just lifted me up and put me down. Oh, I was so seasick. Mm -hmm. God, I was seasick. <laughs> that is the worst thing you can be, is seasick. So then, uh, then the captain told me later, he said, if we hit another storm, he says, don't eat anything but sea biscuit. Mm -hmm. He said, they're the best thing for seasickness. He said, you'll never get seasick of sea biscuits. They're like dog biscuits, believe me. They're <laughs> hard. But lucky we, did. we didn't hit it again. Mm 